guys, it's Queen Asia, and in today's video, I will be reacting <laughs> to episode 6 of Kanesuba, an explosion on this wonderful world. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> that means I can finally leave town and go off. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> mm. Well, in some way, shape, or form, you really did mess up, Meg. No, Mega. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, that's not Mega Me. <laughs> Rico. <laughs> Rico from a whole sky for the Caribbean, like, oh my god, please give me a chance. <laughs> like, I can do it. <laughs> and then Mirai. Mirai's over here, like, Rico, it's okay. That just reminds me, I gotta watch Pretty Girl Fredder. Yeah. Right. You're not that. We sure that. <laughs> What's up, Gingen? Yeah, hers is all pretty!
I know. Damn. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, potato! Oh! And that is why I will never work in food service. Same, babe. I mean, they... <laughs> Keep the shit out of y'all. Dying. Mm -hmm. The question really is, what are you doing out here? She tired. <laughs> Can you carry me home? Damn, you're just gonna fall asleep right there? Hey, baby. Hmm? Oh, I saw a lady from the oven. Yes. Meow, meow, meow. Mm hmm. It's nap time.
You know what? I think that's enough. No, 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 no. <laughs> Baby is like, you sell me for money? Mega mean. Mega mean. <laughs> uh oh, 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 oh. So now I have to kill you. I feel like that's bullshit because you know, hey, demons can lie. Um, okay, we run now. Or, you know, we just capture her entire episode. Uh, Y'all gave her drinks? Sure, because we don't need you to go AWOL again on us. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Oh, God. <laughs> well, yeah, that happened. Oh. 
probably just, you know, wanted to be safe. And she doesn't want to wait any longer. She wouldn't mind. Comes my baby. So true. Mm -hmm. Oh, baby. That's so sweet, oh my god. <laughs> Seriously? Hmm. It just, it happens. Ego. Now you're all 100% you. That was shade. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
they're gonna be hilarious. You know, mm, toads flying cabbages attacking someone. <laughs> Oh. The fact that it was you, you that gave me it. <laughs> It feels bittersweet. Oh my god. Because we know eventually Yun Yun is going to go after her and such. Because of course Yun Yun is lonely precious baby girl. And needs Megamine <laughs> by her side. Once again, Mirai and Rico in a nutshell. <laughs> because they're always together. And if they're apart, they're both sad. And it's just like the cutest thing ever. But it's just like, oh. Um, I can't, once again, I can't go too spoilery on that Pretty Gray series, because people who haven't seen it are going to be like, what? And I'm just like, e <laughs> But it's cute. I love the fact that everybody literally gave her what, you know, she had when you first meet her in the original series and such, because always, I had always wondered, like, okay, what was, you know, did she just buy everything somewhere and such? But no, you get to learn the chief today. This is where she got everything. And now she is officially her. She is officially, uh, like, all powerful Megamine Megamine. And I'm happy for her. She just looks so good. And hopefully, the rest of this journey is <laughs> good. That's all I'll say. Also, I hope the redhead lady, demon lady, comes up again. Because her voice is familiar to me, I don't know who it is. I just know who, I, I'm like, I know I heard that damn voice. Never mind. Like, and uh, one episode later, it continues here. <laughs> I thought it would at least at least be like two or three episodes and then Yun Yun comes back and such. Okay, I gotta ask one question. The the lady who was in white, who was talking to, uh, I'm guessing someone who, I'm about to say priest, um, but ahead of something. Why does she give me feels? It's the one episode in season two. <laughs> you know where I'm going this. Okay, so you know how when they went into this town, it wasn't deserted. It had it had a whole bunch of people, and there was this. Um, it was a little girl. <laughs> that should already give you the clue of what episode I'm talking about. I have not seen this episode in like a long ass time, but um, she gives me feels towards that character where it's like, oh my god, look, I need help. But then also, you know, since you helped me, you, <laughs> you want to give me this. <laughs> I mean, because, like, after that episode, I literally looked at, like, random people who, like, I walked around, like, if I went to Walmart or, like, Target or anything, and if I see someone, I'm all, I'm over here, like, mm-mm, mm-mm. It's the same thing, like, if I go to the fucking gas station, and I'm the type of person where I don't carry cash on me, um, and you know how, like, some people will literally, and I hate to say this, um, fake being, mm, I'm not going to give you, the, the word starts with an H. H. Um, that's all. Not, not the, not the other, other word. The A, the other H word. That's all. Um, and there are some people who really need the money, and then there are ones who like to be evil and, you know, pretend to be like this just to get money. 
And I have seen that firsthand. So, like I said, I am the type of person who, I don't carry cash on me. And I was going to work, I think it was Monday, this past Monday. Um, so I got out of the car and I was like, okay, I'm going to go. My mom wanted me to go get her or something. She wanted to serve me. And so, um, she parked in an area, in a part of the section where it's like, you have to just walk up to, you know, get inside and stuff. So there was this guy, he was just chilling. And first he asked me if I had a lighter. And I'm like, I don't carry no damn lighter. Like, why, why do you think I smoke <laughs> and such? I'm like, no, I don't have a lighter. I'm sorry. Um, so I go in, I get what I get, um, and such. And I come back out and then he asks me again, except not for a lighter this time. He asks me for money. And sometimes, like, a person can be, like, the cleanest as they can be and such. And they will use the fact that, you know, they look they they look clean even though when you look at them or not. And try to, not instigate, but try to persuade someone into giving them money. And that's why I, I, I was one of those who actually didn't look at that and I gave someone money and then they screwed me over. Now, did I go in and ask for that money back? No, but then I'm also very skeptical about who I give my money to and such. And so, once again, looking at that character reminds me of the other character for season two and such. And just over again, but like, yes, watch who you give your money to regardless at the end of the day but <laughs> i'm also glad that union is coming back in the next episode because like i said i was expecting her to at least come back by episode eight or nine um and such maybe but was not expecting her immediately right after megamine officially leaves like i was expecting it just to be like okay megamine's on her own for a little while and then you know <laughs> our non <laughs> our little savior slash rival comes in <laughs> You know, it's something. But I love the fact that we're continuing their adventure together until eventually our other three idiots come in. <laughs> but other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode six of Katasuba, an explosion on this wonderful world. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Enjoy the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Wednesday for episode 7. Bye guys!